What's happening YouTubers, today I'm bringing you a video showing you how you can get around that pesky 3194 error when you're trying to restore your Apple device via iTunes. Now, uh, this can quite often come up if you've jailbroken your device in the past. Uh, Cydia makes an entry into the host file, which we'll be going to in a second, and we need to remove that entry. So um, to get to the host file, what we need to do is on your C drive, go to the C drive folder, go to Windows, uh, double click that folder, then jump on forward to System32, that's System32, not System, just here. We're now looking for drivers, a folder called Drivers, locate that and enter. And the final stop on this route is ETC, double click that folder. Okay, now within this folder you can see a file there called Hosts. This is the one we're going to operate on, but before we do anything else, let's just take a copy of it, give ourselves a little insurance policy because hey, you know, things happen sometimes. So we'll just right click, copy, right click, paste. All right, just continue there. We now have a copy, excuse the flickering screen. Now, uh, we now turn our attention back to the original hosts file. What we want to do is just drag that out of this folder to your desktop. It's the easiest way to uh, administer it. So let's just do that. Hold down the left key, dragging across, it's just asking for uh, permissions, just continue. And here it is on your desktop. Now the next step is to double click it and it will ask us which application do you want to open it with. Uh, we'll say Notepad, it's the best text editor. So double click and voila, the host file. So what we're looking for within the host file is something called gs.apple.com. So let's locate that. Here is gs.apple.com. So what we want to do is highlight that line of text only and delete great it's gone so we'll save it and we do this uh, quite simply we're going to file save close this window which we've been uh, editing and the host file which is on the desktop drag it back into the etc folder we'll ask once again about permissions just okay it 